ama kiwiliwili chake ni kidogo sasa akawa amejaribu na Samido mwenye akahakikisha kwamba ni kweli mtu anaweza akatoshea iwapo unataka kupitia kwenye dirisha. Usema kwamba amelipwa ndipo sasa yeye mwenye akaachilia justice. Yaani alianza DJ Fax ameanza kuorganize groups ambazo zinaanza ku attack the family. Kivita uliwezi kama ni vijana ninao lakini nakuweza kwa utenda kazi. Na mimi nitahakikisha kwamba waluya kule hawakuchagui na tutazidi kupambana. Hey hey mtazamaji wa Cube TV welcome once again to Cube TV channel my name is Sam Jiguna ukipenda niita Samtar kama kawaida every time there is something trending I have to come here na tuweze kuongea ni kujuze mengi sasa moja kwa moja unajua kwamba kumekuwa na hii issue ya DJ Fatso juzi ameenda radio jambo na for the last two days I've covered that story na alipoenda Radio Jambo akawa pale ana mazungumzo na Masawe Japani na Masawe Japani akawa basi pale akiwa live akamwambia kwa na surprise na akampigia mamake Jeff ambaye aliweza kuongea kwa uchungu sana na ikaleta a lot of mixed reactions short tena after that mama Jeff mwenyewe tena hiyo video utaicheki pale pale kwa YouTube channel yangu hii ya Cube TV utafuatilia uweze kujua mama naye akaenda live TikTok baadaye na akaweza tu kama utclear manake kuna watu ambao mitandaoni ambao wanadai kwamba ni marafiki wake DJ Faxo walianza kusema kwamba amelipwa ndipo sasa yeye mwenyewe akaachilia justice yani alianza DJ Faxo ameanza ku organize groups ambazo zinaanza ku attack the family shortly baadaye DJ Faxo tunaona kwamba baada ya ku DPP kusema kwamba hana reason ya ku prosecute jamaa amekuwa akienda kwenye media mitandaoni sasa pale akawa pia eh, amepigwa stop mmoja noma sana na huyu mama na mama akalia kwa akaongea kwa uchungu sana sasa tuna DJ Faxo mwenye akilia sasa leo Pulse Live wali wameandika story ya Samido wakaandika wakasema kwamba Samido wakati wanafanya uchunguzi manake Samido inaaminika kwamba ni mjomba wake marehemu Jeff ni mjomba wake. Kwa hivyo uh, walipo wale uh, DCI walipokuwa nafanya uchunguzi wao, walienda kwenye dirisha na wakafanya uchunguzi kuona kana kwamba mjie mtu anaweza toshea. Sasa katika hali ya kuchunguza walitumia Samido manake inaaminika eh, Samido eh, fizik ama kiwiliwili chake ni kidogo sasa akawa amejaribu na Samido mwenye akahakikisha kwamba ni kweli mtu anaweza akatoshea iwapo unataka kupitia kwenye dirisha. Sasa Pulse imekava. Nani alita story DJ Faxo juzi akiwa kwenye show akasema kwamba hata Samido mwenyewe alisema kwamba pale jamaa za katoshea. lakini Samido alitumika tu wakati wameenda kufanya ile uchunguzi ndani ya nyumba akawa pale kama ni, kama mjomba na kama e, mmoja wa familia sasa wakajaribu kufanya investigation wakifanya investigation wakajaribu na kiwili chake na kusema kwamba ni kweli ukiwa na kiwili kidogo waweza ukatoshea kwa kile kidi sehemu cha dirisha sasa ile eh, walipo cover wale pass wame wame, wame cover na naye Robert Alai <laughs> ambaye ni MCA eh, akaweza kuandika pale ameenda pale akasema Samido <laughs> has been bribed. Samido naye akajitokeza akaenda jamaa ameenda pale naye akaandika kwa sababu jamaa aliandika to eh, eh, Samido has been bribed to save the murderer who is a fellow artist. Akasema nonsense and then akasema a suspect is openly bragging how a serving police officer helped him escape murder charges. Eh alai ni jamaa mmoja ambaye anapenda sana iwapo unafagiliwa ama umeandika chochote when people are positive he always come up na jambo la kwenda against when like guys they are congratulating you nini nini yeye anaandika opposite I remember he did that also to nameless na wahu so he's always coming up with something opposite ambayo itazua na utapata kwamba pale yeye akiandika kama ame comment kwa your page yeye anakuwa the replies <laughs> kwa nini yake zinakuwa nyingi za matusi so the guy rides in that so hapa kwa Samido 
Samido Hana to come to 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 Nani's Facebook. Akaenda pale Samido naye akarespond. <laughs> Japo ashaku msima tu si lakini jamaa akasema we kipi kazi yako ni kutafuta tu relevance na vitu hujui. Sasa Samido akaonekana amekasirika, amekasirika sana. Lakini cha <laughs> lakini cha kushangaza zaidi ni kwamba jamaa akatag Karen Nyamu. Alipomtag yule Karen Nyamu japo ka mention tu Karen Nyamu amekimbia pale bana amewaka na Karen Nyamu sasa akawa amemjibu Robert Alai ambaye nakumbuka kwamba Karen Nyamu yeye mwenyewe ambaye anajiita youth president vile vile kumbuka kwamba ni senator she's a nominated senator na na nini MCA na jam, akamjibu akasema mtu akisikia ukitaja dash dash sitotaja mimi anaweza dhani haina <laughs> for skin <laughs> unaita mtu shoga alafu una, unanitaja kwa kwa nini kwa nini mimi ni mwanaume endelea kufantasize endelea kufantasize uki titi manake mambo mengine ama ma, maneno mengine mimi siwezi taka kuyataja hapa onea lakini haifai kabisa kwa viongozi sasa hiyo ndio ambayo nayo imezua sana utapata kwamba hiyo comment moja iko na zaidi ya 261 Alai hakusita alipoandika Samido naye Alai kamjibu na tunapata kwamba imeattract wakati mimi nimeiona iko imeattract zaidi ya 260 comments kwa hiyo comment moja kwa hivyo sasa sijui ita, itakuwa namna gani napo tunapona kwamba wote ni watu ambao na majina majina tajika wanapoenda pale kwenye mitandao na kutukanana mtazamaji pia itakumbuka juzi tumepata kwamba vile vile eh, mbunge huyu babu wino waimpakasi na yule Salasia the youngest MP kutoka kule Mumias Mumias East na jamaa pia ni mbunge ni mbunge wa Embakasi East wote wamekuwa pia wakijibizana kwenye mitandao nani anasema kwamba kuna utafiti umefanywa wa watenda kazi wa bunge na akasema kwamba there are some MPs ambao ndio wanahusika wakuu kwenye hizi wanaketi chini na kupanga wanaretiwa juu lakini ukienda kwenye ground mambo ni tofauti kabisa sasa jamaa wakaantukanana naye uh, huyu MP Babu Wino akawa anafananisha Salasia bunge Salasia na yule God must be crazy the main character ambaye alihusika kwenye movie kama unaijua ile ya God must be crazy na akamwita kwamba yeye ye. <laughs> ni grandson wa God must be crazy Jamaa naye karudi pale kamwambia mimi huniwezi kivita huniwezi kama ni vijana ninao lakini nakuweza kwa utenda kazi na mimi nitahakikisha kwamba waluya kule hawakuchagui na tutazidi kupambana tuone nani atazidi mwingine basi hayo tu ndio mambo yamekuwa yakiendelea lakini kwa sasa tuna kwamba viongozi wetu daima tu matusi sijui itakuwa vipi lakini let's keep watching keep tuned to Cube TV ni Tasami Njuguna Adios. Kiuk TV, Kiuk TV. Hapa ni Sugunyo, Sugunyo. Kiuk TV, subscribe, subscribe. Kiuk TV. Ngome ya kizungu.